this is an example of what not to do. Make sure, students, that you cover what needs to be covered. If you violate this rule, you will be sent to the office. Now, this could be avoided if he had done this. Here's an example of what students believe is what appropriate you should wear at school, but it violates multiple school rules. Once again, you will be sent to the office. Now, this could be avoided if he had done this. No hats and no sagging. As always, you will be sent to the office. Now, this could be avoided if he had done this. Remember, you must have sleeves. Remember, don't wear pajamas. If you violate this rule, you will be asked to change out. If you do not have any clothes, the office will provide some. Remember, shoes must be worn at all times. Here are multiple violations in this scenario. If you violate this rule, you will be asked to change out. If you do not have any clothes, the office will provide some. <laughs> to start, no hats. You must have sleeves. Remember, shorts are not allowed to be shorter than a hand width from the knee. Remember, students, that you are not allowed to wear slippers at school. Remember, students, that your skirt is not allowed to be shorter than the knee. If it is, you must wear leggings. Remember, students, that when you place your hand on your neck, that the collar of your shirt does not pass the bottom of your hand. If you follow this dress code, you will be cool at school.